Public schools resumed full face-to-face -face classes today. But some schools had no choice but to stick to blended learning due to the lack of classrooms. Marian Enriquez with the report. All public schools in the country are now required to implement five-day face-to-face classes starting November 2. But Batasan Hills National High School says they will continue with blended learning. The school says they have to have two class shifts to accommodate the huge number of students. The school decided that three days will be for in-person classes, while the other two days are for blended learning. This is because the school only has over 100 classrooms to accommodate 18,600 students. If the school pushes through with full face-to-face -face classes, they will have to force around 60 to 90 students inside each classroom. For now, they have divided the standard classroom into two to accommodate 25 students in each classroom. Ano na bang learning ang makikita natin doon sa 31.5 na siksikan? Ito nga ano, 25, mas gusto ng bata doon kasi lahat ng attention ay bibigay doon sa mga bata, lalo na mga slow learner na tututukan. E ngayon, pagsisiksikan mo rito, eh, ayun nga, nasa pandemya tayo, di ba? Pangalawa, siksikan, eh talaga namang hindi conducive to learning yun. At gusto sa mga bata at mga, ano, mga, mga teachers. The school says they need 82 more classrooms to be able to implement the five-day face-to-face classes. Aside from Batasa National High School, 50 schools were also permitted. Depending on the situation, be it natamaan ng calamity, alangan naman ibalik natin yung mga learners pag ganyan, di ba? Kung highly congested, alangan naman isiksiksiksik natin yung mga learners sa isang classroom. DEPED is also studying the possibility of institutionalizing blended learning in public schools as a solution to the classroom shortage in the country. Meanwhile, the DEPED NCR still encourages the wearing of face masks inside classrooms, despite it being made voluntary. If you happen to see it, parang bumalik kami dun sa parang sanay na din na merong mask. So, ang bilin natin ay magmask pa rin. Hindi naman siguro paglabag yun. The Department of Health for its part says that they will defer with the DEPED regarding this policy decision. However, they remind the public that mask wearing will help prevent the transmission of COVID-19. For News 5, Marian Enriquez, we are One News.